This paper is an additional mathematics paper 1. The variant is 1, 2 from session May, June of year 2011. Let's go to the next page which is our formula page where we will have few formulae of algebra and trigonometry. This is our formula page. Let's uh, adjust the page a bit. The first section is for algebra. So here this is and the first formula is the solution of a quadratic equation. The next formula, the next formula is the binomial expansion. This is NCR, the formula for NCR. Uh, let's go to the trigonometry section. Let's go to the trigonometry section where few identities are given. The relationship uh, of different sin, sine and cosine. This is the relationship between sine and cosine, and uh, the next one, next one. This this relationship. This is the relationship between the sec and tan, and uh, the last one. This is the relationship between cosec and cot. The last part in the formula page consists of few formulas from triangles ABC from triangle ABC. The first one is known as sine rule. The first, this is known as sine rule. The second one, the second one that is uh, this formula is known as cosine rule. And the last one, and the last one is called the area of a triangle using the, finding the area of a triangle using the angle sine A. So, now we can go to our first page to start solve the paper. So let's go to the first page. Here, uh, let me adjust the pay view. Okay, we adjusted the page. Now we have a better view. Let's uh, read the question first. Find the value of k for which the x axis is a tangent to the curve y equals to x square plus 2k plus 10 times x plus k square plus 5. So we have to find the value of k for which this x axis becomes a tangent to the curve. This and the curve is this y equals to x square plus 2k plus 10 times x plus k square plus 5. So let's write x axis is uh, tangent, x axis is tangent. So the discriminant of the curve must be 0. So discriminant, discriminant of the curve of the curve that is x square. Uh, that is x square plus 2k plus 10 inside the bracket then times x plus k square plus 5 equals to 0. This is the curve and discriminant of this curve must be equal to must be equal to 0. That, that is b square that is b square minus 4ac equals to 0. So let's find the abc of this curve. Here, 2k plus 10 is the coefficient of x, so our b is 2k plus 10. The coefficient of x square is 1, so a is 1, and the constant is k square plus 5, so therefore c is k square plus 5. So we can write 2k plus 10 whole square minus 4 times 1 times k square plus 5 inside the bracket equals to 0. Now in the next line, taking 2 common from 2k plus 10 whole square, we can write 2 times k plus 5, k plus 5 bracket close whole square and then in the next uh, right hand side we can write 4 times k square plus 5 by taking the entire thing on the other side. Okay. Now in the next line we can write uh, 4 times k plus 5 whole square equals to 4 times k square plus 5. Now from this line we can cross out 4 from both sides so here like this and the next line by expanding k plus 5 whole square we can write we can write uh, k square plus 10k plus 25 equals to k square plus 5. Now we can cross out the k square from both sides. This okay, the k square is crossed out. So now 
we can write 10k equals to 5 minus 25 which gives us 10k which gives us 10k equals to minus 20 minus 20 divided by 10 gives us minus 2 so we can cross out the 0 very easily like this so k equals to minus 2 so finally the value of k is minus 2 for which the x axis becomes the tangent to the given curve now let's go to the next page to start solving the question 2 